Now, because I'm running lowering springs, it actually gives me slight uh, negative camber. It's about one degrees. So I actually run these uh, camber bolts, which you put one on the top. But to set the camber to plus one degrees, to set it to a neutral camber, you need to put both of the original bolts in, and then you set that to zero on a gauge, if I've got it somewhere on one of these gauges, set that to zero and then you uh, take the bolt out, put the camber bolt in and then adjust that one degrees then, and well until it shows on here plus one degrees. Okay so I'm going to go ahead and set the camber um, but I'm actually going to do both sides at the same time so I'm going to go ahead get the old strut off the other side which is the driver's side, uh, change that, put the new one on and I'll set both of them together at the same time. Okay then so there is the one side and there is the other side. Drop link uh, bolted on and uh, I've actually just left this like this because I'm going to do one side at a time with the camera adjustment so these uh, bolts are not torqued down obviously. <laughs> Take that out then. So you know where it is, isn't it? Oh, that means it is going. Just tap it a little tap. Yeah. That hasn't moved, is it? Yeah. Yeah, I see that. And then turn this yeah. what, away from I don't know. What's the other way? Well that, that moved a little bit. Yeah. That's it. It one is it? I thought it was just less than one. Yeah, it is. Well no, I think it's like 0 0.89 degrees per 25 mill millimetre drop. So it is about one. Okay, do the bottom one up then tight. Can't move there. Okay then, so how we are setting the camber to zero, so we want it, you know, our camber to be straight, we don't want negative or positive camber. We are going to make sure both of the original bolts are in, which they are, and then I'm going to put the camber gauge on the brake disc, and I'm going to set this to zero. That's on zero now. Yeah, that's on zero. Now, because I've got 30 millimeter lowering springs, we need to increase the camber by about one degrees. We need to make, we need to add about one degrees of positive camber because 30 millimeter lowering springs adds about one degree of negative camber so we need this gauge to go to one degrees positive so what i'm going to do is i'm going to loosen the bottom bolt slightly and i'm going to actually take the top bolt all the way out and then we're going to put our camber bolt in and that's when we're going to make the adjustments
Okay, so that's the bottom bolt loosened, and that's the top one just nipped up just so it's touching. It's not tight, um, but this should now allow me to move this nut. I don't know if you notice the hub moving slightly there. Okay. So when I turn this, it's bringing the whole, changing the angle of the hub, the camber of the hub, so it's bringing you know it's changing the angle, it's bringing this strut forward or backwards, essentially. Yeah, that's tight. And there we go, positive one camber.